Here we are out at West Lawn Cemetery looking for Grandma and Grandpa Peterson's site. You just saw the sign Craig. We're passing that now. I think this is it right here. Yep. So we'll start over here. This is Alan Peterson. Last name is spelt S-E-N. He, he was born in 1900 and died in 1958. I knew a little bit of him. And we'll cross over by Grandma and Grandpa's. And we'll do Stanley's. This is Stanley's grave. Stanley was born in 1914 and died in 1989. And here is Grandma. Her name was Marin. She was born in 1877 and died in 1972. Conrad, actually his name was Jens Conrad Peterson when he came over from Denmark. And he was born in 1879 and died in 1971. Notice his spelling is S-E-N. Aylens was spelled S-E-N. He was the oldest and Stanley was spelt S-O-N. And what I remember from what my dad Harry said is that there were gang wars in the 20s and the Swedes and the Norwegians beat up the Danish boys and possibly the girls too, I don't know. So Grandpa changed his name to S-O-N back in the 20s. And then later, I think in the 60s, he changed it back to S-E-N originally that was the Danish name. I think it was probably Pedersen with a D in Denmark, though, but it was Peterson here in the States. So that's the story. And then to the left of my mom and dad, Harry and Esther, is my dad's brother, Henry, who was born in 1903 and died in 1966. His wife, Marion, was born in 1904 and died in 2002. We remember Marion, we remember Henry. And evidently they had a baby that I had no idea who this was, but the baby died. So here we are at a West Lawn, right by the Lord's Supper, as you can see. And then we come down here, and this is my mother and father. Harry and Esther Peterson. Harry was born in 1908 and died in 1988. And Esther, Ida, was born in 1906 and died in 1997. Wonderful parents.